So today's what I want to do is I want to show my Samsung Captivate running uh, the newest Cyanogen mod, uh, uh, Cyanogen mod 10.1, which is based off of Android 4.2.1 for the Captivate. And so it's what I want to do today is just go through and show you a few of these things and show some of uh, the things of Jelly Bean and some things about Cyanogen mod. And so let's get to it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and turn on the phone here, and you'll notice immediately here's one difference with Jelly Bean is with the newest Jelly Bean 4.2, you have these lock screen widgets. And uh, you can go in here and you can add uh, these different type of widgets. Uh, there's just a few. There's some uh, apps. Of, I think it's HD widgets you can get from the Play Store that has a whole bunch of uh lock screen widgets and I'm sure there's other apps that do but that's the one that I used have used on on uh, mine uh, so also from the lock screen you can scroll well you can go to the right and open directly up into your camera okay so also jelly bean whenever you uh, drag down your notification bar here you can see how you have access quick access to some of these things uh, go directly into settings okay so let's go ahead and let me show you some things here now notice down here at the bottom uh, under system it says date time accessibility about phone there's no developer options down there but if you uh, and this is specific to signage mod if you go to about phone scroll down and go to build number and tap that I don't know how many times see it says there now you are now a developer so if I go back now down here at the bottom I have developer options and I have uh, access to performance uh, which can change your processor speed and all that type of stuff so uh, they wanted to kind of make that a little bit more difficult for people to get to maybe so they won't screw things up um, okay so let's let me go over to the camera app here you'll be able to see here in the camera app it has a newer camera where you can slide around uh, I can go to different things here real quickly. I can go to different uh, settings there. I can go to settings, change those types of things. Uh, let me go back over here to settings. I want to show you that indeed this is running on Android 4.2.1. So there you go. Um, there's probably more things I could show you on here, but um, just want to show a few of these things about Jelly Bean running on here. Uh, you know, I think people will probably assume that a phone this old wouldn't be able to run Jelly Bean, but it's it's running it smooth. Um, seems to be working just fine on here. Um, one one thing that I want to throw out here real quick is when I was trying to uh, install this CyanogenMod. mod. 10.1 it kept giving me a status 7 error uh, whenever I was trying to flash it inside uh, in clockwork mod and it's what I had to do was uh, go and download uh, the uh, glitch kernel and uh, installed that kernel rebooted then went back into uh, clockwork mod and then I was able to to install it after that so if you're having those kind of problems that might be uh, might be something you could do to kind of help you with that I hope you enjoyed this video today uh, I'm definitely enjoying Jelly Bean on, on this phone and on uh, other phones that I have. Um, if, if you've enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you.